my beautiful people hello it's actually two well three o'clock in the afternoon and let me close this <laughs> um i went to bed at like four in the morning and i just woke up well i just woke up i worked out for a little bit i feel like i'm gonna start trying to work out every day or at least pulling those little arm things so i could get this taken care of uh, <laughs> i think it is broken i think it is broken um i did get a discount on it but every time i like use these hold on do you hear it i don't know and that kind of that kind of annoys me so I was using the arm pulley thingies and my arms are kind of sore, which yes. So I'm gonna try to do it every single day. I'm gonna try to, I'm gonna try to pull those arm thingies every day. Um, anyway, last night could not go to sleep for the life of me. So I started to, da -da -da -da, I started to do my little elephant. I'm not gonna touch it because I woke up this morning and everything was pulled over. <laughs> everything fell over. So I had to re um, glue some stuff, but look at it. My elephant is almost, you can tell, you can obviously tell that <laughs> something's not right here, but I'm like really hoping that I can fix my elephant. Mind you, this is probably like six or seven dollars, um, but I really liked it. So I'm just going to try to like keep it alive. Like it doesn't matter how expensive it was or inexpensive i really liked it so i'm gonna try to like you know put it back together i'm setting up my breakfast right now even though it's like 301 <laughs> i'm setting up my breakfast i am going to have cottage cheese and the pineapple and then also i want to set up my breakfast for tomorrow when i get to work and obviously it's gonna be cottage cheese and pineapple but like, should I use this container or should I use this container? You know, like I could put the pineapple here and the cottage cheese here. Or, because like this is going to be where the pineapple goes and it's kind of like a small amount. I don't know. I don't know. I, I'm, I'm leaning towards this one. I feel like this one is the more practical use one anyway i'm about to make my breakfast i set it up i have my cottage cheese here my pineapple here which i feel like i put too much pineapple but we'll see then i'm just gonna cover it up and this will just be one last thing i have to worry about because i do have to get up really early tomorrow so i'm gonna definitely eat my breakfast at work although when i get up really early like that i kind of like to eat my breakfast um home but um, tomorrow, I'm just gonna like grab this and go. But like, <sighs> oh. Anyway, so here's my breakfast. And also, oops, made a little dribble over here. Also, I realized that the reason why I like Daisy other than the other ones is cause like the, the little uh, curds or whatever, are like uniform there's not like they're all like the same size pieces you know like it's not like some that's like okay well whatever the majority of them are like uniformly packed and i like that i like it because especially people who deal in with like a texture type thing which um i don't have a problem with it obviously because i'm eating cottage cheese but um yeah that's why i like daisy anyway so i looked on here and like I want some avocado toast, right? Doesn't that look good? Like for people who like avocado toast and like, I don't know, like feta cheese and things like that. I think they would like this, but like, oh my goodness, with tomato? Oh, I feel like that's gonna be like a great sandwich. Gotta look into that. Anyway, I'm about to eat my breakfast, put all in my stuff. It's gonna be great. Today is gonna be a great morning. Well, a great afternoon, actually oh my goodness you guys this is so good this is so good i think i'm gonna make this um instead of buying like the pre-pack thing i think oh my goodness it's i put too much pineapples because it's a little too sweet but like it is so good oh this is a good decision i'm really happy i have my hair it's about to be dried i just dipped the ends and i think you can kind of tell like 
whatever so i just did the ends because they were getting kind of frayed but yeah it's better it's better i'm really happy about it so now i know like how to fix um the wigs and this is where i have it because the ends were dipped and with this type of synthetic hair it like doesn't drip you know anyway so i just had it hanging here anyway that cottage cheese is so good i know a lot of people don't like cottage cheese and i hear ya i hear ya hold on oh <laughs> and like recorded some of that pop you on a tripod but like i am breaking out so bad i have like pimple patches strategically placed on my body um and you guys see like oh do you see all the like discolored bumps and stuff it's not on this side it's just on this side <sighs> my face is breaking out so much i'm trying to like like every three days i feel like i break out and it's like clockwork and nothing has changed like i'll either break out if i'm like not wearing makeup like if i haven't worn makeup in like a week still break out every three days if i wear makeup still break out every three days um like nothing has changed like i don't know i don't know anyway i never had acne as much as i do now as an adult i've never had acne have i I mean, I guess I kind of did have acne as a kid, but not like as badly as now. Like to the point where like I is leaving like dark marks. Like even if I pop them or if I don't pop them. <sighs> TMI, I know, I know. But um, I just took a shower this morning. I worked out for a little bit. I was like doing those arm things just to try to get rid of the, I think I told you guys that already. But I just felt so like, energized like last night i was trying to like put put together my elephant i was like drinking hot chocolate i was like having my like time of my life texting my friends all this other stuff anyway i just got to shower but i kind of want to work out some more but i know i need to calm down <laughs> um it's just only because like pace yourself like i just started to work out again i don't want to like hurt myself in the process of like you know Anyway, so I just made some grits, not just made, they're like already cooled down, but I made some grits and turkey sausage and I have another one over here. I think one of these is going to be my lunch for tomorrow. Um, I go to work early and when I have my lunch, it's going to be like brunch hours, so might as well just do it now. And I also got to remember to turn on this light because I cut it off to do a haul or something like that. And... Um, I haven't cut it on and I need to cut it on around like four o'clock in the morning that way it doesn't like I don't know when I'm gonna cut it on but I do have to cut these lights on when I wake up tomorrow ah I did my nails over and I don't I think I'm getting good at it I think I'm getting better as you can see like this part whatever but I think I'm getting better at it I just need to keep practicing you know keep doing it and then I'll learn how to do it better um I still don't know how to do my feet so I mean I have like the gel and stuff like that so I can do my feet like with gel but this new um UV light or whatever the the new container it like hurts my hands like right here I think I'm gonna have to like invest in some gloves to like hold, cover it because like at first I thought I was just like in my mind but I don't know it's making my I don't know the skin here is a little irritated after i use it so i gotta figure that out and also i'm gonna google it to see if, if i'm the only other one that like feels the burn on my skin <laughs> last night when i was texting my friends uh i got an email not an email a notification from walmart saying like a crazy sale so it's like all right whatever let me just see what they have so crazy sale you guys it was a crazy sale and I was like the weirdest thing like but I picked up some things and they're like really really cheap I think I picked up a dress that's like four dollars which you guys know I'm really cheap anyway um and then I also picked up some more things I just don't remember what they were but I know my bill was under fifty dollars which I was really excited about because the things that I got cost more than fifty dollars uh, also got me a sugar-free hazelnut syrup I can't wait to have it 
I'm like salivating because you guys know I like hazelnut in my coffee so and I have hazelnut syrup here but it's like not the sugar-free kind and I'm trying to like cut back my consumption of sugar um yeah so it's supposed to come in like two days two, yeah two days from now because it was last night I placed, yesterday I placed the order anyway my friend has like um my friend's daughter she has like an obsession with lol dolls right and i'm like okay whatever but i see that there's like a crazy sale on lol dolls like a pack of like eight i think it was lol dolls was twenty dollars but the original price was like around a hundred dollars or sixty dollars I forget I forget there was a bunch of different ones like that so I did a screen grab of um, it and I was sending it to my friend and he was telling me that his daughter has all of them and I'm like okay it's like a crazy deal like and I was sending him screen grabs of like the the mansions and all that like the doll houses and stuff like that and he was like oh she already got it but then this morning he texts me that the price went back up the price went up from twenty dollars to like a hundred or something dollars and i was like you should just let me buy it and i was like place in the order um but he was like she's missing two so trying to get those two dolls two dolls anyway um i just felt good because like whenever i see like a sale and stuff and i think of my friends like i always do that like even though he did, didn't buy the lol dolls until today which the prices went up it's still a deal but not like as good as the 20 dollar one that i had he was like he's so mad <laughs> you know <laughs> i don't know why that makes me feel good but it's like now he knows about this deal and it's still a good deal he said so it just makes me feel good that I, I can like, you know, notify my friend when like a good deal is happening and something that they want or their kids want. It just makes me feel good. It makes me feel like a good aunt. <laughs> uh, whew. Whew. Oh my goodness, I didn't show you what I was up to so far. Okay, so this is what I got to you. I did some. Ooh. Oh, stuck to the counter. No. I think I stuck it to the counter. No. Oh, I did stick it to the counter. Oh, wasn't so bad. All right. Okay. So this is what I got so far. Um, this piece here, I don't know. It just wouldn't go for me. It just wouldn't act right. Anyway, so I got that and. I did the two arms, so now I just gotta focus on the back of the neck and the back. But like, I know this piece, I think anyway, I think this piece goes, nope, where's it this piece? Yeah, so I know this piece goes here like that, but I also, I'm just, I'm trying to get this bottom piece first so like because like i don't know how i'm gonna like hold this in place until it glues so i'm just gonna like i just need to get the bottom in place first yeah which sounds easy enough but isn't <sighs> these are all the pieces that i picked up so these are all the pieces that i have left and it does not seem like it's gonna fix the hole you know like, does it look like it's going to fix the hole? No. Look, the amount of pieces I have. <sighs> I'm really sad about it. Or maybe I can, like, shave this down and just have put a candle inside it or something. I don't know. I don't know what I'm thinking. Hi, guys. Hello. It is the next morning, and I am putting on my earrings. Look at the other one, though patch thing is still on it i'm gonna let it rock until like it falls off to be honest this little pimple patch thing but i have been doing oh my god go on sweet jesus i feel like 
when you have nails on and you're not like used to having nails on, you have to learn things over again. Okay, so I've decided, cause before, um, before I used to put on like my base makeup and then put on my wig and then do my eyebrows and eyelashes. But you would not believe how many times I left the house without doing my eyelashes or my eyebrows and no, no, no. So, um, I do them partially. Like I want my eyelashes, I don't know if you guys can see more. But I want my eyelashes to be a little bit more fuller, so I'm going to do another coat. Um, but if I don't do another coat, it's still fine. I'm wearing my earrings that my boyfriend got me. You guys, I'm a mess. I know. I had to put so much powder on. You guys can't tell, but inside, but like, if I look at myself in a mirror, it's like super powdery. But I'm going to put on my... I'm gonna put on my wig because I have, I think, 20 minutes left before I have to leave. Sweet Jesus, go on. Yeah. Putting on my wig, I messed up my little, whatever you want to call, my little baby hairs. I messed them up. I think I'm getting good at it though. Like. I think I'm get, I think I'm getting good at it anyway. Ooh, let's see if it's even. Okay, they're kind of even. You can tell this one is a little, it's a little off, but it's okay. I don't know what's going on, cause like when I first wore this wig, I used to never get it like, like I don't know, like used to always be on point, right? Like I used to never have it lopsided. Now it's like always lopsided. Alright, so I'm gonna make my eyelashes a little bit fuller and then I have to go make my eggs. Oh, I cannot rave about it. Lash Paradise is my favorite mascara. If you guys have any like mascara that you like and you think I would like, um, let me know. But you gotta have to have tried Lash Paradise first, you know? Like, you have to have tried Lash Paradise and you're like, oh, it's good, but this is a better type of thing. It's a lot. I gotta go make my okay, eggs. So, my friend um, broke up with his girlfriend. Hold on. With his girlfriend of two years. Now, mind you, he. I knew this relationship wasn't gonna last. Like, sorry, does this look bad? Does this look bad? Anyway, so I knew this relationship wasn't going to last between him and her, but I'm trying to be supportive. And he's my ex-boyfriend, Eddie. Should I do two eggs? I'm going to scramble the eggs, you guys, because, you know, why not? I'm going to scramble them in the pot. So it could be like less dishes to clean. Uh, ooh, these yolks are like really orange. I love that. My friend Eddie broke up with his girlfriend, but he knew like it wasn't going to work like three months into being in a relationship with her, right? And I'm just like, he moves in with her, you guys. Ooh, sounds weird. Okay, making some some eggs. I'm just gonna scramble it in the pot um, for like less dishes <laughs> to clean. Okay, so my friend broke up with his girlfriend, right? And it's so messy. It's so messy. Like he knew that it wasn't gonna work. Like three months of to dating her, and. But he stuck it out, you know, like, he stuck it out, but then, I don't know, this is the grimy part, and this is why I'm not on his side, um, like, me and his sister is not on his side, like, at all. By the way, I'm just scrambling two eggs, which is done. 
them take like a minute to make eggs thank goodness anyway um so they they've been going out for two years now and they even moved in together like a year a year into like like a year into being together and moving together but he knew and she knew that this wasn't like a, a long relationship like she's even said it on multiple occasions not to me but again this is like i'm hearing it from like my my best friend crystal anyway this is my grits in sausage i'm gonna add the cheese to it um and i actually need to add some salt too because i did not salt anything okay should i put butter on it Oh, I didn't, put the egg. I didn't put the cheese in it. Anyway, long story short, they adopt. Oh, you can't even see me, you guys. All right, so long story short, they adopt a puppy. They adopt a puppy um, less than like six months ago, I want to say, and they're at the dog park. And my friend sees this girl, and she's with her puppy that she just got. And the two puppies like each other, whatever, whatever. They exchange numbers. Um, and there's like a group chat between like my friend, his girlfriend, and the new girl. I just I just broke a nail. I'm so sad. Oh, I'm so sad I just broke a nail. I really broke it. <laughs> Okay, a lot of stuff was happening when I was trying to make my food. I broke a nail. I glued it back on. It seems like it's fine. Um, every My eggs is fine. I put the cheese on top of it. Everything is looking good. Alright, this is going to here. Then I have the second layer. And then I, like I put too much pineapple on it. We'll see when I get to work. I need a snack bar <laughs> i'm gonna finish the story about my friend actually i should take two i have one in my locker just in case i want some snacks Lunch is done. Da -da -da -da. All right, coffee. Nah. And I put like some fiber powder in it last night, so I wouldn't have to worry about putting it in this morning. Also, put hazelnut syrup in it. Oh. Oh God! Definitely put too much hazelnut. Oh, really did put it in my face. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Okay, so I realized that I was talking, but I wasn't saying anything. I have four minutes to tell you guys what happened with my friend. And I'm going to tell you guys. Because uh, I want to tell you guys now while it's like, while it's like fresh. Oh. Okay, so my friend... Oops. Sorry for the nipplage. Anyway, so my friend broke up with his girlfriend. Two years of like, one year of living with each other, I think. And like two years of like actually dating, I think. I'm not sure about the, the timeline. Anyway, but they've been together two years. Um, they decided to have an open relationship. So this is the second friend that I know um, had an open relationship. Um, like, I don't know what it's called, but it's like they're in a relationship, but they can see other people and pursue other relationships, not just like hook up with people. Anyway, um, so he was trying anything to like stay in a relationship with her because he didn't want to break her heart, whatever, whatever, yada, yada, yada. They decided to do open relationship. Um, 
and then like she was seeing someone and he like hooked up with someone anyway um they take their puppy that's like six months they take him to the dog park and they see another puppy and you know like have a conversation with the girl that was a puppy owner anyway <laughs> so she sees him he sees her whatever 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 um they exchange numbers like all three of them girlfriend new girl and my friend so they change exchange the numbers they're on a group chat all of a sudden then my friend starts having a private group chat with a girl and one thing led to another long story short he broke up with his girlfriend mind you he doesn't have they live together you know like he's on the leash she's on the leash they live together they're he doesn't have any money saved to move to a different place and he spent the night over at the new girl's house i'm so disappointed in him like like, I'm trying to, I'm going to use an analogy that doesn't really fit, but, like, if you're looking for a new job, you keep your job you have until you have a secure other job, you know? Especially if you're not, like, financially stable where you could take a couple months off to, like, actually pursue a different career. Um, he didn't even, like, prepare. He just, like, which I'm not trying to tell him, like, he should have, like, had a little nest egg so he could just move out immediately and stuff like that. But it's like he doesn't know if he's guaranteed with this new girl and then what i'm hearing with her is that like she was flirting with him the whole time but she like met his girlfriend was talking to his girlfriend knows he has a girlfriend so i'm just like the way you get him is how you lose them and my friend he's very like into like love and all that stuff and he's not a cheater but like that's why he broke up with his girlfriend so he can with this new girl i think now you can see all the powder i put on my face i think anyway um it's just i mean i told him he could chill out here he could crash here for a couple of days if need be but uh i don't know if my boyfriend is really gonna appreciate that um seeing how my friend is also one of my exes um you know <clears throat> Uh, the friend that I'm talking about is my first boyfriend, but I'm a friend with his sister. His sister's my best friend. Whatever. I gotta go to work, you guys. I'm gonna talk. I'm gonna. <clears throat> I'm gonna talk more about it like later. I think because I'm not really like explaining it in all its detail because there's like layers. All right. I gotta go to work, <sighs> and I will see you guys in the next clip or. If this video is too long in the next video that I'm gonna post at 2 p.m.